These are today's Jeffrey highlights. Originally from Boston, Massachusetts, Matthew Ott. From Syracuse, New York, Ellen LaBerge. From Falls Church, Virginia, Sriram Krishna. Here are your categories in the Jeopardy round. Song title tile 600. Stevie Wonder, Sir Blank, Sriram. What is Duke? Sir Duke, you got it. What is Princes? That's correct. What is Queen? Yes, a thousand more for you. What is King? Yes. Table Talk 800. Those with high IQs may know this five letter name of the organization whose name is the Latin for table. Ellen. What is Mensa? That's it. Who is Archimedes? That's his law. What is the stratosphere? That's right. Who is Athena? Yes. What is Marvelous? That's correct, and we'll finish it off in table talk. Figuratively or literally, negotiations to reach an agreement and often thwart a strike are held here. Sriram. What's the bargaining table? That's right, you have $1,000. Here's the double jeopardy round and the categories. State postal abbreviation word 1600, please. Molten rock that reaches the surface. Sriram. What are Louisiana and Virginia? Lava, you got it. What are Pennsylvania and Nebraska? Pain, you got it. What are Washington and North Dakota? Yes. What is Pose? Right. Uh, TV 2000? The answer there <laughs> is a daily double. <laughs> I'll wager 3,800. All right, you'll have the lead if you're correct. TV final episodes. When this show ended on April 10th, 2022, one of the two female leads was dead. Which? Well, the show didn't live up to its title. What is Killing Eve? That's correct. You now have... Jab. 11,600, and we have spoiled the ending of Killing Eve for those who didn't see it. Was Friday Night Lights? Yes. Was Pandemonium? That's it. Who are government employees? Good for 2,000. Was Lolita? Right. All right. Sriram took the lead back with his charge there at the end of Double Jeopardy, but it's a close game. Today, Final Jeopardy will concern 1970s movies, it seems. Let's take a look at the clue. A 1975 premiere of this comedy advertised free coconuts for the first thousand in the audience. Ellen LeBurge in the middle had $7,800. What was her response? What is Monty Python and the Holy Grail? Yes, the clip-clop of horses' hooves in the movies are coconuts striking on each other. So you're going to add ooh, $7,000 to your total. You have $14,800, and for the moment, the lead. Matthew Ott was in second place with $11,600. Did he know it was Monty Python and the Holy Grail? He did, and he got it all written in 30 seconds. Kind of a long title. Well done. So you will add... Oh, hello, 11,597. You now have $23,197. Sri Ram Krishnan, did he write down Monty Python and the Holy Grail? No, bananas. Hey, you thought of a fruit-themed 70s comedy. That's pretty good, but we're gonna take away $10,000, leaving you with 4,200. Matthew Ott, you are our new Jeopardy! champion for the weekend. $23,197. Click the subscribe button below and never miss another highlight. It's just like Jeopardy, but bite-sized. <laughs>